Hey guys, Jason Kelly here with Walnut Ridge Family RV. Another cool walkthrough Wednesday. Um, I'm standing in front of the Passport 3400QD. This is a GT series, so that means you're gonna have the fiber, fiberglass front cab, um, power front home jack, as well as the solid step and a couple more nice features there. Um, so the power tongue jack is one of my favorite features. You just push a button, you don't have to crank on it, it's awesome. Um, huge pass-through storage, well lit for the evenings when you're getting to that campsite late and trying to get everything unpacked. So it makes it, makes it nice for you, you don't have to hold a flashlight that way. So um, Now it does have power stabilizer jacks. You never want to level with these jacks. They're not really designed for that, but it does help out in the process. You just push a button and the jacks go down. So um, this, this feature, the outdoor kitchen, is extremely nice. If you're cooking fish out at the campground, you don't want the camper to smell like fish, just do it outside. Great big power awning, huge power awning, well lit with the LED lights there. Uh, outdoor speakers, indoor speakers. The stereo is actually Bluetooth capable as well. So if you don't have service for the radio, you can obviously just send save music over on your cell phone. Let's go inside and check out the uh, interior of this coach. One of my favorite features about the 3400 is all the storage you get, as well as the nice bunk system in the back. This coach is more focused on the kids, I think, which is a really, really nice feature. Um, a nice big closet there. So all the guys come in, have coats on, just toss them right in there. Um, and you do have the private bedroom here, which is extremely nice. So you've got the nice, solid panels here really cool um, well designed nice big storage under the bed and then nice hanging lockers one on each side and you do have enough room I believe on each side of the of the bed there for a CPAP machine if you if you needed one and then power outlets and USB ports I don't know if you can see that back there now this coach sleeps a ton of people. So this is a high to bed, it'll fold out, as well as the U-shaped dinette. The U-shaped dinette is great for one or two adults. Um, here's your stereo, Bluetooth capable. This one doesn't have the CD or DVD, but that's quite all right. You can just stick a DVD player right in here. Uh, propane electric fridge, huge. My, my camper actually has a very similar fridge and it's plenty for a week or a weekend. Nice counter space. That's one thing that's hard to get in a camper. I don't know if you guys have tried to prep food. You still have this this space that's close to the to the kitchen here to prep food, which is a nice nice feature as well. More storage back here, and you also have storage. I want to point out, cool blue LED light, but uh, you also have more storage all the way around in this U-shaped dinette. Um, one of the things we always look for in our camper is more storage, and this this coach has it. So again, nice, nice big closet here. You've got two drawers down here and then a really nice shower, plenty of space. And then the kids kingdom. So you have the big, huge double quad bunks, nice, nice size TV. They can game back here on a rainy day or watch movies and stay out of your hair if you're up front. But the storage alone on this couch, I mean, you have two huge hanging lockers, one on each side of the television, and then a really nice cargo door. These have This has the same steps, um, the solid steps that the, the front entry has there. So you could, in, in theory, probably finagle a kayak or two in through here. So um, really cool coach. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to shout out. Um, we'd love to get back with you.